Egypt is a land where history still lives in harmony with the modern world. It is a land of mysteries, a land where ancient civilizations blend with the vibrancy of modern life. From the towering pyramids of Giza to the bustling streets of Cairo, Egypt is a country always ready to amaze you. It is a place where the rich history and unique culture set it apart from the rest of the world. But what is Egypt like today? How has it evolved over the centuries? And what makes it a truly remarkable destination? Join us in this video as we journey through this incredible country. We will dive into its fascinating history and also explore the challenges it faces today in the modern world. But before we start, please take a second to like and subscribe to our channel. Egypt was once considered one of the most significant civilizations in the world. Its history dates back to 4000 BC, when the country's oldest city, Fayum, was built on the western bank of the Nile River. With time, the ancient Egyptians kept building their cities around the Nile, which was the lifeblood of their civilization. This river flowing through the country's center provided them with water, food, and transportation, allowing them to expand their society. At the center of ancient Egypt was a system of powerful pharaohs who ruled with absolute authority. These pharaohs were seen more as gods on earth than just rulers of a land. Being at the top of the greatest civilization of their time, their wealth was beyond measure. They were able to build monuments that stand as a testament to their greatness even today. One of the most iconic symbols of their greatness is the pyramids. These pyramids were built as tombs for the pharaohs and filled with treasures you cannot imagine. These massive structures are a symbol of the incredible skills and engineering ability of the ancient Egyptians. No one knows or has been able to accurately figure out how they were built with the precision and engineering skill they were. Despite thousands of years of excavation and study, the pyramids still hold many secrets, and the true purpose of these structures remains a mystery to this day. The majestic pyramids and the fascinating temples also prove that the ancient Egyptians were masters of art and religion. The art and artifacts found in these historical places offer a glimpse into their beliefs and daily life. From the elaborate tombs and sarcophagi to the intricate hieroglyphics on temple walls, the art of ancient Egypt is both beautiful and mysterious. The Egyptians worshipped a pantheon of gods and goddesses, and their religious beliefs are visible on these monuments. The mysterious hieroglyphics on the monuments also reflect Egyptian kingdom's powerful and dynamic history. Did you know that the ancient civilization of Egypt was never just a single era? Its history is divided into three kingdoms, each with its unique culture and history. The Old Kingdom, for example, saw the construction of the pyramids. It is why this kingdom is known as the Age of Pyramids. The second period in Egyptian history started in 2055 BC, known as the Middle Kingdom or the Golden Age. It was an era for art and literature. It was also the time when the pharaohs from the Old Kingdom were buried in hidden tombs. After that came the New Kingdom or Imperial Age in 1550 BC, the last dynasty of ancient Egypt, which brought more wealth and prosperity to the land. It ended in 1070 BC with the arrival of the late period, which marked the decline of the ancient Egyptian civilization. Even though the ancient civilization of Egypt is long gone, its essence still lives on in modern day Egypt. Today, Egypt is a bustling country with a culture deeply rooted in its ancient past. From the iconic pyramids to the beautiful temples and monuments, the country is a living museum of its rich heritage. Egypt has a rich and fascinating history that has stood the test of time. The culture of Egypt is as unique and vibrant as it was thousands of years ago. Egyptians are dedicated to their religion, which is why their culture is highly tangled with their religious values. In ancient times, the Egyptians believed in an afterlife and that their gods controlled the forces of nature and the fate of the people. They built temples to honor their gods and performed rituals to ensure their blessings. This religious tradition has continued in modern-day Egypt, where most of the population is Muslim, and the country is known for its stunning Islamic architecture, such as the Al-Azhar Mosque and the Citadel of Saladin. It's not just the architecture, though. The Egyptians are masters of paintings and sculptures, 
The best examples are found in their temples and the hieroglyphics that tell the stories of their ancient times. Today, Egyptian artists continue to express their cultural heritage through their work, whether through traditional forms like calligraphy or more modern forms like street art. Egyptians' culture is not just limited to the beautiful monuments and intricate art we often associate it with. There is also a rich music, dance, and cinema tradition that continues to thrive today. Whether you are a fan of classical music or modern pop, there is always something that suits your taste in Egypt. The country's music scene is rich and diverse, with various styles, from traditional folk music to contemporary pop. One of the most unique and captivating forms of music in Egypt is the makam, a system of melody types that has its roots in the ancient Middle East. Egypt is also the country where Oud, a popular musical instrument, was first designed. It is specifically used in Egyptian melodies and forms a major part of the country's culture. And let's not forget about dance. In Egypt, dance is more than just a form of entertainment, it's a celebration, a way of life. Belly dancing originated in this country and is now a famous dance form worldwide. Egypt is also known for having one of the world's oldest and most vibrant film industries. The country has produced many critically acclaimed movies, and its cinemas are often filled with excited moviegoers. With its rich history, stunning landscapes, and talented actors, it is no wonder that Egypt has become a popular filming destination for many international productions, and the Egyptian film industry has been named Hollywood on the Nile. Egypt is known for its rich history and cultural heritage, but it is also home to the second largest economy in Africa. Over the years, the country has been working hard to unlock that potential, and today, it is one of the fastest growing economies in the Middle East and Africa. Egypt has transformed itself into a regional economic powerhouse by building its five key industries, agriculture, tourism, petroleum, natural gas, and media. Among these industries, agriculture is the pulse of Egypt's economy. Thanks to the fertile land along the Nile River, Egypt has grown various crops, including cotton, wheat, corn, and rice. The country is one of the world's largest long-stable cotton producers and is a significant exporter of other agricultural products. Another key driver of the Egyptian economy is tourism, which accounts for 12% of the country's GDP. With its ancient pyramids and monuments, vibrant cities, and stunning beaches along the Red Sea, it is no wonder that millions of tourists visit Egypt each year. In recent years, the government has been promoting tourism and making it easier for tourists to visit the country. This has not only boosted the economy, but also helped to create jobs and improve the standard of living for Egyptians. The petroleum and natural gas industry is another significant contributor to the Egyptian economy. The country is rich in these resources, which it exports to countries around the world. In the past decade, Egypt's oil sector has seen impressive growth. According to official figures, crude oil's contribution to its GDP reached an annual average of 152 billion Egyptian pounds, registering a 47% growth rate over the same period. This remarkable development in Egypt's economy is attributed to increased investments in the country's energy sector and its commitment to achieving energy independence. Let's not forget about the new Suez Canal, recently built in Egypt in 2015. It is a significant engineering achievement meant to boost the country's economy and demonstrate its resurgence on the global stage. The canal, which runs parallel to the original Suez Canal, is a symbol of Egypt's determination to reclaim its place as a major player in the African continent. It has increased the country's strategic importance as a hub for global trade and commerce, because it has become the main route for the transportation of consumer goods and commodities exported from the Middle East and Asia to Europe. As Egypt is at the center of it, this canal boosts the country's economy by generating revenue from shipping fees and providing thousands of job opportunities. As a result of its booming economy, Egypt has a high standard of living. In terms of income, Egypt has seen steady growth over the past decade, with a GDP per capita of around 
$500 in 2022. Although this is still lower than some other countries in the region, it is a significant improvement from previous years and is a positive sign for the future. Even though Egypt has made progress in improving the living conditions of its citizens, challenges such as high unemployment rates, income inequality, poverty, and illiteracy are still there. To fight these challenges and further improve the quality of life, the government of Egypt has recently acquired a whopping $3 billion loan from the International Monetary Fund. It is important to remember here that the stability and growth of a country's economy and its standard of living are directly impacted by the political stability and decisions made by the government. Anything in the political arena, from reforms and policies to major events and shifts, can significantly affect the economy. From ancient dynasties to modern times, Egypt has undergone positive and negative changes. From the Egyptian Revolution of 1919, which helped pave the way for the country's independence from British rule to the 1952 revolution, which ended the monarchy and established a republic, Egypt has undergone significant political transformations. In 2011, widespread protests erupted across the Middle East and North Africa, including Egypt, dubbed the Arab Spring. These demonstrations were driven by a desire for political change and an end to corruption and authoritarianism. In Egypt, protesters took to the streets to demand the resignation of President Hosni Mubarak, who had been in power for over 30 years. After 18 days of protests and a mounting death toll, Mubarak stepped down, marking the end of an era in Egyptian politics. Why do we call it the end of an era? Because it was the first wave of the Egyptian revolution. Following Mubarak's resignation, Mohamed Morsi was elected Egypt's first ever democratically elected president. The country was at peace, but not for long. Egypt was soon thrown into chaos once again. Nationwide protests broke against the government's perceived drift towards more significant Islamist influence. In 2013, the military staged a coup, overthrowing the democratically elected government and installing General Abdel el-Sisi as the new president. General el-Sisi made a dramatic appearance on television to announce the removal of Morsi from office, the suspension of the constitution, and the installation of an interim government. After that, el-Sisi took a hardline approach to security and dissent, cracking down on opposition groups and jailing thousands of political opponents. A few months later, General el-Sisi, the military's commander-in-chief, was promoted to field marshal, Egypt's highest army rank. He was also given the military's blessing to run for president. El-Sisi is still the president of Egypt, maintaining a tight grip on the country's politics and security. Despite some criticism and controversy over his methods and human rights record, many Egyptians credit El-Sisi with restoring stability and security to the country after years of turmoil and unrest. His rule has also been marked by a wave of economic reforms aimed at modernizing the country's infrastructure and boosting its economy. Despite the stability brought by El Sisi's government, Egypt has continued to experience periods of political unrest. In recent years, several protests and demonstrations have been driven by frustration with the government's handling of the economy and its restrictions on political freedom. In September 2019, Egyptians gathered in Tahrir Square, Cairo, and other cities across the country to express their frustrations with corruption and their desire for more transparency and accountability from their government. The protests were largely peaceful, with people carrying signs, singing songs, and calling for change. However, the government's response was swift and harsh. President El Sisi's government deployed security forces to disperse the crowds, and there were reports of tear gas and rubber bullets being used against the protesters. In the days following the protests, the government arrested thousands of people, including journalists, activists, and anyone suspected of being involved in the demonstrations. It was Egypt's biggest wave of arrests since El Sisi took office in 2014. Human rights organizations like Amnesty International and Human Rights Watch condemned the government's actions and called for the immediate release of all who had been arrested for peacefully expressing their opinions. 
So a few days after the initial protests, El Sisi announced that he was taking steps to investigate allegations of corruption and that any officials found guilty would be held accountable. While many remained skeptical of this promise, it was seen as a positive step forward. The government also began releasing those arrested, and the protests started to die. However, September 2019 left an unforgettable mark on the country. They showed that Egyptians were not afraid to speak out against corruption and injustice, and that they were willing to risk arrest and violence to fight for what they believed in. Egypt has come a long way since the time of the pharaohs, from ancient civilizations, through its long history of colonization, to its revolution and present day, Egypt has been an influential and important player in the region. It has been at the forefront of efforts to combat terrorism and extremism and has maintained close ties with major powers such as the United States and Russia. Egypt has undergone numerous political changes throughout its history, including the collapse of its kingdoms, the rise of the Republic, hundreds of protests, and the recent Arab Spring Revolution. Today, it continues to play a role in shaping the Middle East, and its economy has continued to grow despite the country's challenges. Even after all the political unrest, Egypt is a symbol of stability and resilience, with a long and rich history that will continue to influence the region for generations. Thanks for watching till the end, and don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to our channel for more videos.